big pile of hounds and you're a hairy one. Yes, mummy. After a pretty uneventful flight to Dar es Salaam, we begin our descent, check the seatbelts, and I woke up with that on my face. Annoy mum for a bit, look out the window, oh that's pretty nice. Right, we've landed, make sure we haven't left any crap behind. Welcome to Tanzania. Getting off the plane, ooh, we're top. Try and talk to the camera, but forget there's a jet engine going on in the background. Onto the bus. Cram ourselves through the door into the hottest airport ever, push through some people, ponder about life's many troubles. Quick scan of the old fingerprints, and now it's time to figure out how to get a visa. Get told to stand over there and wait for our names to be called. Did I mention it was boiling hot? <laughs> Two thousand years later. Thank you. <sighs> Too many clothes. Right, back to talking to the camera, and I get top off by security. Off to find a taxi. Oh, there he is. Introduce ourselves. Hey, Anna. We're bargain with a taxi driver. Bargain with a SIM card provider. Jump into the taxi and get stuck in Dar es Salaam traffic. Cue car journey montage. Looks like we made it to the house. Say hello to all the big dogs and get escorted in. Through the door, bags down, argue about who gets the ensuite room. I'm not the ensuite bathroom. It's settled then. B, I'm sorry, your name? Connor. 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 Hi. Finish your greetings, go around the corner, into my room, bags down, bedtime. <laughs>